Good morning, dear Gurukula aspirants. This is K. Ganga Prasad. I am dealing pedagogy of biological sciences. In this pedagogy of biological sciences, our first unit is nature of science. First unit is nature of science. In this nature of science, there are there are a few subtopics. Let us see those subtopics. In this nature of science, let us learn about. Let us learn about introduction. Nature of science. Characteristic features of science. characteristic features of science, definitions of science, definitions proposed by various scientists such as Henry Poincar and Schwab and Phoenix. Next contribution of scientists, contribution of scientists more emphasis on more emphasis on school textbooks so our first unit is nature of science in this nature of nature of science let us learn a few topics few subtopics such as introduction the nature of science in this nature of science we will learn what is science and how the term science was developed characteristic features of science definitions of science contributions of scientists more emphasis we show more emphasis or we give more preference about the scientists that were discussed or the part of the school textbooks right next Next, if you see the question arises, what is science? The question arises, what is science? Science is nothing but the way of exploring the nature. In our nature, we will observe a lot of natural phenomena and these natural phenomena has hidden truths in them. Our science explores them. Our science is a way to explore those natural phenomena. Why these natural phenomena are occurring? What is the reason behind this? What happens if these natural phenomena will stop? What is the reason why they are occurring? So, science is a way to explore the nature, to explore the hidden truths of the nature. So, here what is science? Next, science, science it constructs scientific knowledge, science constructs scientific knowledge, science constructs scientific knowledge, right? Science is constructing scientific knowledge. So, here to construct scientific knowledge, it will use some processes. It will use some processes, some process skills to construct a scientific knowledge. So, we say science is nothing but a constructed knowledge which consists of scientific processes that we use. We use scientific processes to construct the scientific knowledge such as facts, truths, concepts, generalizations, principles, laws, theories. So, to construct the scientific knowledge, we use scientific processes to construct, to construct scientific knowledge 
scientific knowledge we use we use science process skills science process skills what are those process skills what are those process skills those process skills are those process skills are observation collecting information making hypotheses making hypotheses testing hypotheses are testing hypotheses in the sense doing experiment right doing experiments we do experiments to know whether the hypothesis is correct or not we frame a hypothesis what is hypothesis a possible solution to a problem hypothesis is nothing but a possible solution to a problem so you frame one hypothesis and you test this hypothesis by doing the experiment right so testing hypothesis or doing experiments drawing results drawing results or conclusions making inference making inference and measurement measurement classification classification prediction so all these are all these are process skills all these are what process skills we use process skills we use process skills to construct scientific knowledge to construct scientific knowledge what are process skills the first and foremost very 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 important very 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 important is observation of course all process skills are important all process skills are important but in science the first and foremost important process skill is observation if you observe you will get doubts for example there is a natural phenomenon that is occurring in your surroundings me parisara prantallo edaina oka prakruti lo jarige oka drugvishyam jarugutund anukondi first meer em chestaru meer danni parishilistharu parishilinchadam is nothing but observation right so you observe you observe whenever you observe whenever you observe you will get doubts why it is occurring adu enduku jarugutundi adu enduku jaragali dani venaka unna rahasyam enti ani right so the first and very very important process skill is observation right observation so here when you observe when you observe you will get doubts you will get doubts you will get doubts to clarify the doubts you collect the information you collect the information from your for example if you are a student you collect the information from your teachers professors elders friends you collect the information from the print media electronic media you collect the information from the internet right so here observation is the very very important process skill in the scientific process skills right so when you observe you will get doubts so that you will collect the information you will collect the information then you classify the information again you classify the information you classify the information based on this information based on this information you will make a hypothesis you make a hypothesis what is meant by hypothesis a hypothesis is a possible to solution to a problem a tentative solution to a problem right that is hypothesis to test the hypothesis to test the hypothesis you conduct the experiment or testing hypothesis testing 
hypothesis you will do the experiment if you will get the positive results if you get the positive results positive result in the sense what for example ipo meeru oka hypothesis frame cheskunnaru hypothesis ante manam em antam ante prak kalpanalu cheyadam prak kalpanalu cheskuntam manam oka dan gurinchi oka solution ee problem ki ee solution undi ani manam ఒక మెంటల్ పిక్చర్ అనేది ఫ్రేమ్ చేసుకుంటాం అది దాన్ని మనం హైపోతసిస్ అన్నాం రైట్ దట్ ఈస్ కాల్డ్ ఎస్ హైపోతసిస్ అండ్ ఇఫ్ యువర్ హైపోతసిస్ ఈజ్ రైట్ ఇట్ విల్ మ్యాచ్ విత్ యువర్ ఎక్స్పెరిమెంటల్ రిజల్ట్ ఎస్ ఆర్ నో టు టెస్ట్ దిస్ వన్ టు యూ విల్ డూ ద ఎక్స్పెరిమెంట్స్ దెన్ ఆఫ్టర్ కండక్టింగ్ ద ఎక్స్పెరిమెంట్స్ యూ విల్ డ్రా ద రిజల్ట్స్ యూ విల్ మేక్ ఇన్ఫరెన్స్ రికార్డింగ్ రిపోర్టింగ్ ద ఇన్ఫర్మేషన్ ఇన్ ద ఫార్మ్ ఆఫ్ ద ఇన్ఫరెన్స్ measurement of certain things classification prediction all these are the process skills so you use process skills you use process skills to construct what to construct scientific knowledge to construct scientific knowledge right what is accumulated or what is included in scientific knowledge scientific knowledge ante andulo em undi let us see scientific knowledge అంటే రైట్ నెక్స్ట్ సి నెక్స్ట్ ఐ విల్ ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్ వాట్ ఈస్ మీట్ బై సైంటిఫిక్ నాలెడ్జ్ సో వీ యూస్ సైంటిఫిక్ ప్రాసెస్ స్కిల్స్ వీ యూస్ సైంటిఫిక్ ప్రాసెస్ స్కిల్స్ టు కన్స్ట్రక్ట్ సైంటిఫిక్ నాలెడ్జ్ రైట్ సో హియర్ సైంటిఫిక్ నాలెడ్జ్ scientific knowledge so see we use science process skills science process skills manamu science process skills use chestunnam right for what to construct scientific knowledge to construct scientific knowledge so here based on your observation based on your collecting information making hypothesis testing hypothesis drawing result right ivanni chesin tarvata you will get a product you will get a product ipudu deenni manam process ankundam if it is a process you will get a product and that product is called scientific knowledge scientific knowledge if this is a process it is a product when you do a process you will get a product meer edaina oka pan chesthe product vastunda munde product ready ga untunda for example if you want to cook a dish meeku oka dish prepare cheyal anukunte you first you will arrange all the ingredients and you will make a procedure or you will follow a process to make that dish right so in the same way you will uh use these uh, process skills to construct a scientific knowledge and it is known as a product it is known as a product scientific knowledge is called as a product then what are included in these products right so see facts truths concepts generalizations generalizations right principles laws and theories all these are what all these are products product is nothing but scientific knowledge in science i mean to say we use a science we use science to construct scientific knowledge right scientific knowledge and construct cheyalante manake em kavali manaku process skills kavali so we use process skills we use process skills to construct the scientific knowledge and this scientific knowledge is called as a, a product when these are called when these process skills are called process process and this is called as a product product includes facts 
truths, concepts, generalizations, principles, laws, theories, all these are products. So, I mean to say that science is nothing but it is a tool to construct the scientific knowledge, it is a tool to construct the scientific knowledge by careful observation, by careful observation and following a certain process skills to develop theories or to develop scientific knowledge that includes facts, truths, concepts, generalizations, principles, laws and theories. Right? The first and foremost thing in science is scientific inquiry, not enquiry, it is inquiry. So, see what is scientific inquiry? Scientific inquiry is the primary tool, scientific inquiry is the primary tool, scientific inquiry is the primary tool primary tool to construct scientific knowledge to construct scientific knowledge what is meant by inquiry 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 ante it is not enquiry, enquiry ante vicharana, inquiry ante anveshana. Inquiry ante enti anveshana. Then anvesh is the science. Science, inquiry, the uh, natural phenomena, the things that occur in the natural phenomena. Mana natural phenomena, mana prakritilo jarge drugvishala gurinchi, vatilo unde rahasyala gurinchi telskuntundi science. So, Inquiry is nothing but to know, to know about facts or truths or truths that are hidden, that are hidden in nature, that are hidden in nature. Prakriti lo dagi unna rahasyalan. Kanukovadanki oka sadhananga oka tool gamanamu scientific inquiry ni use jesthana manjiptanam. So scientific inquiry, scientific inquiry, scientific inquiry is the primary tool to construct the scientific knowledge, right? So there is a certain uh, procedure or a certain method in this scientific inquiry. So in this scientific inquiry, let me tell you. Scientific inquiry, the first step is observation, the first step is observation, second one is collecting information, collecting information, third one is making hypothesis, a generalized, a general chepe steps with then ki scientific inquiry ki making hypothesis. Next, making hypothesis, conducting experiment or testing hypothesis, conducting experiment or testing hypothesis, drawing conclusions, drawing conclusions, and from these conclusions, from these conclusions you will get a fact, you will get a fact, right? So, here we are talking about scientific inquiry, we are talking about scientific inquiry. Scientific inquiry is a tool to construct the scientific knowledge, it is the primary tool, very basic tool, right? To construct the scientific knowledge and some steps, generalized ga manam cheptam e steps, then ki e inquiry, inquiry, inquiry lo unde steps evi, inquiry is nothing but anveshan andi, then anvesh is tundi satya andi, so the name and tunnam manam satya anveshan and tunnam, right? 
inquiry right so observation for example there is a phenomena natural phenomena that occurring that is occurring in your surroundings first you observe then you collect the information then you make hypothesis then you uh, conduct the experiment so test the hypothesis and after drawing the conclusions you will find out the facts you will find out the facts so here this is the way this is the way to find out the fact or a truth that is hidden in the nature in the universe right 